know, sometimes people will come up and ask me why I got into television. My answer is always the same, to foster understanding between the sexes. <laughs> we always get a good chuckle out of that one. <laughs> the truth is, I got into television because I'm just like television. TV and I were born around the same time <laughs> and with the same lousy reception. When TV and I were young, we were both small. We saw everything in black and white, and we spent most of the day sitting quietly in the corner. <laughs> but it wasn't long before TV hit the cable age, and I hit middle age, and that's when we started to grow apart. <laughs> we both got wider, but my viewpoint got narrower. <laughs> the TV got less static, I got more. <laughs> the only thing we had in common was you could press our buttons without even getting up off the couch. <laughs> Now, Harold tells me that pretty soon the TV will also be the computer, the stereo, and the phone. The hardest working thing in the house. <laughs> Needless to say, this is where TV and I part company. <laughs> Remember, I'm pulling for you. We're all in this together. Well, you know how some people can't leave well enough alone? Well, if that's the case here, they found some new way of watching the Red Green Show. The expression flogging a dead horse also comes to mind. Anyway, there's some link somewhere. They're going to put it on the screen probably right over my face if I know these guys. And you follow that and all the instructions and everything there. But apparently they, have, they schedule and they watch shows or they put a bunch of handyman corners together or they, who knows what they're going to do. But it's interactive, which means you actually get to interact, which of course I was never interested in doing. But uh, we got somebody who is. Uh, check it out. Uh, if you don't enjoy it, don't call me.